you might have seen Shuriri's video on his really cool movement map and tried to install it and had no idea what to do. And I get it, I'm a visual learner. That GitHub installation is good if you know what you're doing. So that's what this video is going to be about, teaching you how to install it and some cool things I found out about it. So make sure to watch until the end. The first thing you're going to do is go to the link in the description titled Apex Movement Map, and it's going to be a GitHub link, and it should bring you right here. Then what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to click on the blue link titled mp underscore rr underscore desert lands underscore common dot nut. That should install the file. Once your file is completely finished installing, you're going to want to drag it into your r5 reloaded folder. If you've not already installed r5 reloaded, watch my other video on it. It's linked in the top right corner. So, you're going to open up your base r5 reloaded folder titled whatever you named it. Mine is personally named r5 reloaded, as you can see. Then you're going to go into the platform folder, the scripts folder, vscripts, mp, and then levels. Once you're here, you're going to want to drag the folder into this file. It might say that it's already in the des destination. Make sure to hit replace file and destination. If you have any issues, make sure you're on the latest date of R5 Reloaded. It's a very common issue because compatibility might be a little bit weird. The most recent file is linked in the top in the video that I've already linked, which will also be in the description. So go check that out if you're having any issues. Now you're going to want to open the game. Once the game is completely open, make sure to go to create server, select playlist, then you're going to want to go to survival.dev and then choose the map World's Edge. Once you're in the game, you'll see this massive floating movement structure map. And to get to it, you're going to either need to teleport or use no clip. To enable both of these, you'll need to open the console using the tilde key, which is the key next to the one, then type in sv underscore cheats space one, which allows cheats on the server. Then you're going to want to bind no clip to something. Personally, I prefer p, so I'll do bind p space no clip. This allows me to fly at any speed. Right clicking can make me go faster. Then, if you would like to use the teleport function used in this map with checkpoints and other things, you'll want to go to my description with all of these other links and paste and commands that I've been using. You're going to open the console again and paste it in there. So, what will happen is J will go to your current checkpoint, K will go to the next checkpoint, and L will go to the previous checkpoint. The creator of all of this map is Triri and his friends. And if you want to figure out all of the different movement techs that they decided to use throughout this map course, go check out his video because he's way better at movement than me. Even though I run a movement channel, he runs a better one. So make sure to go check out his video showcasing all of these things and where they can be found in the different maps. And that's about it. Thank you all for watching and make sure to like and sub because I'm really close to a thousand subscribers and that's fucking massive. So, I will see you all later. Bye now.